What is self-care? Self-care is described as taking concrete steps to nourish your health and well-being. Why is self-care important? It boosts your physical health as a result. It boosts your mental health. It helps establish the foundation for better health all around. Self-care prevents burnout, fatigue or tiredness, physical illness and mental illness. What is negative stress? It causes anxiety or concern. It can be short or long term. It is perceived as outside of our coping abilities. Decreases performance. Can lead to mental or physical problems. With negative stress, you feel unpleasant. How to cope with current and future stress? Coping with current and future stress can be done by self-care. Self-care is a way to take care of yourself and includes physical care, your body, mental care, your mind, spiritual care, your soul, and emotional care, your feelings. How can self-care support your mental health? By mindful interaction with one's environment, using schedules, nutrition and exercise, mindful breathing, learn to summon relaxation, creativity and music. Mindfulness means maintaining a moment-by-moment -moment awareness of your thoughts, emotions, bodily sensations and surrounding environment with openness and curiosity. To have mindful interaction with your environment and others, you need to try be positive. Start each day being thankful. Count your blessings. Be kind to others. Be kind to yourself and forgive yourself. Appreciate the world around you. Enhance your relationships with family and friends. Let go of things you cannot control. Focus on the present. Focus on good things in your day. How to practice mindful breathing. Find a quiet, comfortable area to sit. Notice and relax your body. Breathe in through your nose, down to your belly, until it's full of air. Breathe out through your mouth. Tune into breathing slowly, in and out. Do not let your mind wander. Concentrate on your breathing. Do this for five to seven minutes. Using schedules can help mental health and well-being. Routine and discipline is important as it reduces stress. As you are better organized, reduce the need to plan. It creates order, saves time and creates good habits. It breaks bad habits. Practice and skills are better. Do important tasks first. Reduces the need for willpower. Reduces delaying what needs to be done. Builds momentum and energy. The following food fights depression and anxiety and is healthy to eat. Chicken, nuts, whole grains such as oats, canned beans, corn, sorghum and brown rice. Avocados, spinach and tomatoes. Walking can help relieve stress. It gives you time to think as well as time to get away from stresses. Getting out of the stressful environment, breathing the air and feeling your body move is natural stress relief. Take one day at a time. Do not overwhelm yourself. Focus on the positive outcome of the exercise when you feel negative. If you do not like to go for a walk, start dancing. Azonto or shoki. Mow the lawn. Wash the floors. Sweep the sidewalk. Learn to summon relaxation. Benson's relaxation technique. Find a quiet, comfortable area to sit. Close your eyes. Deeply relax all your muscles. 
begin at your feet. Work up to your face. Keep them relaxed while breathing through your nose. Creativity and innovation to express yourself has a positive effect on your mind. Sing, dance, write, draw pictures, knit, sew, crochet, or build ornaments out of wood, iron, or paper. Teach your children games from your childhood. Get a pet to take care of. To be creative, de-stresses and activates your mind. Helps you focus. Makes you feel fulfilled. Music. Music is the language of the spirit. It opens the secret of life, bringing peace, abolishing strife. Khalil Gibran. Music can relieve stress and anxiety. Upbeat music can make you feel positive. Slower music can relax your mind and muscles. Music increases confidence and communication skills. Music will make you more self-aware. Self-care means taking the time to do things that help you live well and improve both your physical health and mental health.